Hello everybody, Tinfoil How Lady here. How y'all doing out there in the world? I'm doing okay. Got it, got Christmas done, got New Year's done, and this year is the Chinese water rabbit year, which is my year. I'm a water rabbit, so I'm a little bit nervous. Um, uh, I'm not sure if it's good luck or bad luck when it's your year. If anybody knows, please let me know. Also, I wanted to let you know that I got another voiceover gig. And this one I'm pretty excited about. It's for the fifth season of a children's television animated series. And I get to voice um, a wise old turtle and a prairie dog. <laughs> so I haven't seen the, a whole script yet or anything, but uh, I have to drive two and a half hours south to go to the studio. And um, I had to confirm my Canadian uh, citizenship to be part of this project. So that's kind of exciting. And uh, I also wanted to say I'm so proud of Tom McDonald with his song Ghost going number one in the pop charts and being played on the radio. Finally, he made a love song for Nova. Now they just have to get married. And I'm wearing my We Are The Brave shirt, of course. But the new albums on HangoverGang.com, Renegade and The Revolution. Tom has them for you. Cheap as dirt. 15 bucks each. 17 or 20 songs on each CD, such a deal, right from Tom's house to your mailbox. It's amazing. So what else do I want to talk about? <sighs> the world is your oyster. It's all up here. So if you can control your thoughts and get a handle on your emotional reactions, because a reaction is different than a response, then you're 10 steps ahead. Remember, you wanna come up to your upper chambers. In our society, we're mostly stuck in the solar plexus, which is the highest of the lowest chambers. And the lowest chambers are representative of your physical body, your emotional body, and your intellectual body, your mental body. And these are all controllable. So unless you come to your heart, which is the bridge to your masculine upper chambers, all that wild feminine chaotic energy down there is just going to be manipulated by, you know who, the enemy. So, please, whatever you do this year, try to remain calm. That's my best advice for any situation. Try to remain calm. It's very difficult sometimes, but do your best to listen and to not react. Again, a reaction is different than a response. A response is fully processed and comes right from your upper chamber, fifth chakra, your throat chakra, and it's ability to respond, response ability. And that's where we want to really come from. But to do that, we have to burn the ego through the flame of the heart. No man comes to the father except through me. So happy new year. I hope you're doing well wherever you are out there. And I just thought I'd better check in, right, TJ? And just tell everybody about my new gig. So I'm pretty excited. I don't know what the name of the show is for real. I think we're just using a working title right now. But once I've done everything, I'll let you guys know. And I might even do a little filming, you know, on my way down there and maybe on my way back, let you know how I felt about it. But I'm really excited to be part of this, um, this production. I love doing voiceover. Nobody has to look at you. You just talk to the microphone and it's awesome. So there you go. God is smiling on me. That's like one, two, three. This will be my fourth gig in less than a year from, uh, from my agent this year. So I'm, I'm, really, I'm really pumped about that. Sometimes one door closes, like in your medical technology degree, career. It's so weird that I can't use my my medical education anymore. Well, at least at this point. Maybe eventually they would let me do something. Can't take blood. You're supposed to be, you know, be booped for that. And then the mask thing, like my lips are still, I don't know if you guys can see, but there is like a really dark line right there. And then right there and right there. And then what it feels like inside to my lip, it feels like I ate too many salt and vinegar chips. So there's this weird numbness. And it's on the tip of my tongue, too. It's like it, my tongue is 
numb or something. And it's been over a year since I've, you know, worn a mask. So I'm still permanently damaged as far as I know, with no recompense, no recourse, nobody cares. But I care. So, and I know you care too. Take care. Love you lots. Thanks for being there. Leave me a comment, subscribe, thumbs up, share all the stuff. All right. Peace out.